What's happening? The Wanderer has returned. Hello, 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 hello. How are you feeling? Fine, yeah, just a bit tired after last night's drive, but I'm what, all good. What time do you get in? 2 a.m. ish. So, 2 a.m. Uh, but then Luke messaged me saying we had to get up at, fa at 4.45. And so. it is, let's see what the time is, 5.36. So, so it's, it's about an hour drive to the airport. But, uh, yeah, my body feels really good. I didn't do any drinking, no party. I stayed away from all the vans, fan zones and stuff. I went to a nice like, wee nightclub chilled out thing with air conditioning the day of the, the match and just chilled so yeah body feels good got some sun and I feel good so that's the main thing and in case you haven't realised we are now on our way to World Strongest Man 2022 so we're leaving from Inverness Airport travelling down to Heathrow Dan our coach has come in on the flight from Heathrow unfortunately so sorry who's ever sitting next to Dan from Heathrow we fly out to San Francisco and we've got a car to take us to the so venue. We've got one less, one less trip, one less flight this time, so it's good. After the long flight, no more flying. So we'll go and check in. Hopefully, it'll all go okay, and we'll see you through in the departures. We, me and Simon being we, are in San Francisco, uh, ready to meet the lads off their flight to go to Sacramento, ready to start World's Strongest Man. Competition starts in four or five days, I think. So just waiting for them to land because we were all booked on different flight. I think Simon only found out what time his flight was um, about 20 minutes before we should have been on it. So, bit of a panic this morning, bit of a drama with everything going on, but we're here, we're ready, and it is world's strongest man time. I feel really good, you know, at the moment, I feel really tired. I think we're like 24 hours into being awake, but um, good night's sleep, get the groups, some meetings and stuff out the way tomorrow. Bit of a, like, deload session, just to get the flight out of the system and then, ready to go you know they're in better shape than they've ever been uh, compared to last year they're you know next level athletes compared to where they were so this year it's up to everyone else to beat them approximately 10 hours later yeah you got some food yeah we got some food i some juice man we've got water in there sunshine on a rainy day Makes me horny. Boom! Where are we? We're in San Francisco. San, San Francisco? Yeah. That was a good flight. It's Usually we get to America at like 2 in the morning, so it's good. We are driving from San Francisco to uh, Sacramento. So we have got our wee, uh, sprinter. sprinter. Steve, Steve will do it, just lent us a sprinter van. See the hotel, get a wee swim later on. Let's go. Just arrived in Sacramento, a little bit tired. Long journey, so it's about kind of half eight now. I'm just going to order, get a wee Uber Eats. What are you getting for dinner tonight? Burgers, like always. Burgers. Shake Shack or Five Guys, one of them. Yeah, so yeah, Shake Shack, I think, tonight for me. Um, and then try and get some sleep. And then tomorrow, we have a athlete meeting at 8 o'clock in the morning, 8 till 10. Uh, we find out groups via YouTube through uh, Laws and Liz's page and World Strawyers Man, see who's in the groups and then just a chill day after that, so <coughs> get used to the jet lag and stuff. Yeah. So uh, you, you all know the, the events, all the events have been released. <coughs> They're all the same for each group, so it's not really, doesn't really make too much difference. But we're going to go over the rules tomorrow, chat about that. Um, I think there's a couple of things like the wrecking, the wrecking ball hole, just to kind of see what the crack is there. We haven't really done, we've done it, but we have press it. Yeah, oh, sure, that's that's a fine. Fine, I'm not. <laughs> Yeah, so we're going over it. I think it's all the events for the qualifiers tomorrow. Um, the only two that are thing you did that wrecking ball in the car car walk. But yeah. Apart from that, how was the journey here? Because obviously you got separated. Yeah. So the journey. Yeah. <laughs> well, 
we probably Simon probably wouldn't actually be here if Dan didn't text me saying, "Oh, my flight's at half 11 and then I asked Simon to check the ticket. He said, "Yeah, I'm there." Who gave us fist pumps and away he went. So Simon and Dan were here a few hours before us, and yeah, our flight was chilled. Um, good thing about it, we only flew in when to Heathrow. He flew to San Fran and then drove from San Fran. So I think that's much better than yeah, waiting the, waiting in an airport for another two three hours to get a 20 minute flight. So. I think it was much better this time. Yeah, it was so. nice. It was actually quite good. I think Kush and Sinead had a nice sleep. How Sinead? Sinead's leg? Yeah, sure. sure it'll be fine. I mean, yeah. she's, what happened? She, uh, so we were in Seville, right? And uh, walking down this alleyway, and this gang said, Oh, that's big Tom Stoughton. Then just battered us both. Huh? But uh, she got bit by a mosquito. Get, when she gets bite, she gets allergic reaction. So. Like insect bite? Yeah, insect bite. So she has to just turn her legs swelled up and stuff. But, but she's got some antihistamines and some I mean, She's still walking, she's still here, so that's the main thing. So it's all good. So no, it's nice to be here where we made it. I think all the athletes now are just looking like everyone's getting out, which is good. Um, managed to get through the security or the uh, immigration checks and everything. That was all fine, that was good, um, no problem. Simon, did you get through right? It was a bit of a weird, <laughs> weird one. Uh, I wonder why, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Simon got interrogated a little bit too much. But no, it was good. Just seeing Brian Shaw outside, Martins, Alexi, Big Adam Bishop. It was nice to see all the all guys. All those faces here. and then all this. It's nice that everyone's here with families as well, which yeah. is good, you know. Back to kind of normality now. No masks at all on the planes, which I really liked. No masks anywhere now, yeah. so it's a bit of freedom, which is good to see yeah. as well. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it's good. So we're going to go up to bed get a shower because we're both a bit smelly from the flight and then that's it so tomorrow will be exciting I don't think there's much on apart from the meeting and then I think so Saturday's a chill day pretty much then Sunday Monday's like interviews and media stuff the usual stuff we do filmization yeah. and everything so by the way we're tired we're gonna go to bed and eat food so we'll chat to you before we're about to switch the lights out so we'll see you in bed sorry guys it's a little shitty here Oh, right guys, that's me in my bed. Oh, oh. It's been about 30 hours since I've been in my bed. I want to get all tucked in and then when it's lights out, I'll say goodnight to you all. I'll see you in a wee second. Oh. Hey guys, so that's me just tucked up in bed. Um, quite a comfy bed actually, quite cosy so. I'm sure I'll sleep like a baby tonight, just had Shake Shark Burger, uh, double burger with fries and a nice strawberry milkshake, so quite happy. Kush went down and got some food from the little shop, she just had some crisps, she's tired as well, so um, yeah, I think we'll get a nice sleep tonight and then, as we've said, up nice and early tomorrow we've got the meetings and stuff to go over, so so I think it's time to say goodnight. Um, Kush? Oh, yuck! Disgusting! Ah! Right guys, hope you enjoyed that day of travelling. Sorry we get, didn't get to show you as much as we liked, but we were just too busy travelling. Obviously we couldn't show you much because our video guy got taken away from us earlier. So yeah, it was just myself and Luke. Anyway, that's us here. We're tired, we've had our food, so we're going to go to sleep and uh, get up nice and refreshed for tomorrow. And it's nice having it, so it's nice being here at 10pm instead of 2, 3 in the morning like we usually are. But just quick one, we're not actually sharing the same bed, this is just a little prank. Tom's going to go to his room, which will show you the difference in rooms on one of the next videos, because Tom's room is huge. Fit for a king, the world's strongest man. Stay safe, smile, and stay spicy. And please don't forget to ring that little bell. I'm out of here, guys. Ding, 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 ding